Andres and we're today we're jumping into Attack on Titan. This is season one, episode three. Ooh, I like that. This anime has been one of my favorite shows to actually react to. It is so short and it gives me what I need. Um, so a lot of you guys, I asked the question, I don't know if a lot of people seen it, in the comment section down below in the last reaction. I said, did you guys want me to do, I was, I was kind of confused between like sub and dub and dub and sub and I was kind of like, Ugh. I didn't know what to really call it. But I was pretty, pretty much saying, do you guys want this in English, English version or this version? As an actor myself, I generally, the, the reason why I always keep it to whatever language it is, is because those actors, um, even voice acting, I hear, never done it before, but I hear voice acting is extremely hard. Um, so also, I just don't want to take away from the actual performance of these creators, these actors that put in all this time and energy in giving up a performance just because I don't speak their language and I want to hear it in English. So, um, I was going to, though, because I wasn't sure people wanted me to uh, just try out the English version. I was teetering on it, but I really feel as an actor and somebody who appreciates it so much and, and I actually really do love this show that I really think I'm going to keep it to the original content of the language that it is. I do have um, closed capturing on it but I know the closed capturing says uh, different words than actually what the show says so I haven't been putting on the closed capturing over it because I don't like I don't know um I'm debating if I'm gonna do it in this episode I feel like I might try it I'm not sure I'm not sure or I'll keep it to whatever the show says I'll probably keep it to what the show says I'm still debating it as you can see but for those that want to see this in English only um I feel like I really it, it would be something that um I personally it, it's personally can't go through because of how much I love acting and I appreciate the people who do it. Not saying you guys don't appreciate it. I do know that it'd be easier for other people to follow. Then maybe if you're like walking around and you know, you have it on and you don't know what the hell they're saying um, and so you would hear it in English, it would be better for you guys. Um, and I completely understand those um, other things. But for me, I think I'm going to just keep, not think, I'm going to keep it into um, the regular the language that it was brought to us um, and I'm going to res respect it for me. It just It's just a personal thing for me. But I do 100% understand those would love to see it in English. Um, you never know. Maybe, I, you know, it's possible it's, it's possible that if the vast majority of people were like, I need it in English, um, I would probably, maybe I'll try it out in one episode. I have no idea. But it would just, it would, it would uh, hurt me to do it. <laughs> to tell you the truth. Um, and trust me, it's hard for me to follow sometimes, but I'm making it work. But anyways, regardless, guys, this show, once again, is amazing. And it seems like now we have our our characters, Erwin and the other two. I, I, I see how to say, the, the, how to spell their names, but I can't pronounce it yet. Um, but those three characters are obviously now joining into this um, group, this army, this militia that's going to go attack these big giant people that like to smile and don't have any clothes um, and like to eat other people. I guess they just don't want to eat trees and plants. They are not herbivores. They are definitely carnivores. Um, it seems like they're not even trying to be omnivores. Um, ooh, there's a lot of boars. <laughs> But, um, yes, yeah, so I'm still trying to figure out what that other giant titan person was. The titans are the giant people, right? Duh. Um, you know, somebody just say, yeah, the, the last titan that we saw that could run through stuff and started breathing fire, that was the only episode. So I was like, okay, because I was like, is he a dragon? Um, you know. Hmm. But regardless, guys, I'm ready to jump into this. Maybe we're going to get a little time jump a little bit. Maybe not. Um, there is like 25 episodes in this this uh, season, so I'm sure they didn't time jump. But I'm ready to jump and dive into this right away. So, <clears throat> this will be available for a full reaction from a second third tier here on the YouTube platform. And this will be on the platform, Patreon. So guys, who signed up to one of those platforms and help support the channel? Today, I'm a reactor. It's time to react to things. With that being said, let's jump into Attack on the Titan and find out exactly what this lovely anime has got to give. Ooh. 
I like that. <laughs> the Mr. Despair, Recovery of Mankind, Part 1. それは素晴らしいな。3列目。後ろ向け。貴様は何者だ。目指すと言う。大木様の体なんぞ欲しくない。ここにスプリンが。ウォルローゼ南区中村出身です。最初に教えたはずだ。この敬礼は大木に心臓を捧げる決意を示すのか。大木様。何をやっている。ウォルロー
昨日巨人を皆殺しにしてやるとか言ってたやつだよな役立たずに食わせる飯はねえからよエレンもう仕方ないよ明日できるようになればいいんだからすることなんかもうそんなこと目指すべきじゃないでも命を投げ打つことだけが戦うことじゃないお前の見ちまったんだぞそんな理屈で納得できると思うのかになれるかどうか判断するのはエレンじゃないから私は何もエレンだけ開拓地に戻れと言ってるんじゃないその時は私も一緒に行くからそれもらってもいいってことですか異性制御のコツだって悪いけど俺天才だから感じろとしか言えん人が頭下げて頼んでるのにでもさお前昨日力のないものは去ればいいって言ってなかった才能のないやつは去るしかないだっけどっちだったっけすまんがぶら下がるのにコツがいるとは思え期待するような助言はできそうにないな志願しなくの出身だよねそうだけど巨人の恐ろしさも知ってるはずだなのにどうして兵士を目指すのあめちゃくちゃなだ立派なことだよああ帰れなくなった故郷に帰る俺の中にあるのはこれだけだ君は何で兵士に俺は殺さなきゃならねえと思ったこの手で巨人どもを皆殺しにしなきゃならねえ巨人と遭遇しても心が折れることはなかったっていうのかでは兵士になれるかどうかってとこだけど<音声>ベルトの調整から見直してみろ明日はうまくいく<音声>エレン・イエガーだったっけああありがとうエレン・イエガー覚悟はいいかはいやろういくつなんか知らん根拠もないでも俺にはそれしかねえ俺の武器だおおああ俺は下ろせすぐなイエーガーとベルトの交換をしろ装備の欠陥だ貴様が使用していたベルトの金具が破損していた後に整備項目に加える必要があるなじゃああいつ壊れた装備で一時はって判断は問題ない修練に励め自分とも戦えるもうお前に世話を焼かれることもねえなアナレスに進んだと思って安心してる。今日お前の息子が兵士になったぞああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああああ We're gonna call me an M for right now.、Um, and so I get their names down pat. It's only the fourth episode, guys.、Um, but yeah, so E, I, I like the character, but he has a lot of flaws with him. I feel like he's just like, he's just so ready to die. And like, you know what I mean? Like, he's like, I'm gonna go kill these big, tall Titan people、um, because they killed my mother, which I can completely understand. But he's not ready, he's not evil, he's not um, um, fully equipped to actually do it. And even if he does, he could definitely still、uh, be appreciative of Mikasa, Mikasa、um, M、um, for b- being the protector because she's looked out for him since the first episode. She is literally、um, taking that role of what the mother said very seriously. I really do enjoy that character. She is one of my favorite characters. There's a lot of mystery with that character as well. Like, I'm just always trying to figure out, like, Why she she's she seems like a very big deal. Um, and she's protected him since episode one. And without her, he probably would have died within the first five minutes. And it's only a 24 minute show, so boop. Um, that's an accomplishment. So, overall. This episode definitely was showing us the training process very quickly about everything and, and introduced to us all these other characters that I'm sure we're going to、uh, continue to see throughout the episode, throughout the season, I should say.、Um, and they're very interesting. Very,、uh, I'm kind of confused what happened with that guy who was interested in the girl and mentioned her hair. And then when she said, you know, about cutting it, 
he was wiped his hand and said that was me getting rid of trust of anybody and it was like um you just met her and that's her hair dude you're weird um bye so but yeah so overall overall this was a weaker episode of the other episodes i did see but it's really just because i didn't see giant naked people eat other people so um but it was still very good very quick to the point I enjoyed the little ride, and I really do. I really do enjoy these characters for what I've seen thus far. Now, guys, please do me a favor and please share this to every platform you're on. I would like to bring um, the the people that love this animation over to this channel so we can discuss down below. Also, when you guys are liking, sharing, and commenting down below, not only does it help the channel, but it always alerts me on my phone <laughs> that you guys are commenting and liking the video, and that brings that pushes me to put out more reactions of this show and all of my shows here on this channel i think that's the driving force for me just to see more people interact with the the, the content that i put out it really does i'm always like yes 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 i'll be all day at work like oh my god i can't wait to go home so i can put out another content for you guys um so please um please share Share it to the Twitter platform of this show, Attack on the Titans. Please share it to your Facebook and as well as your Instagram. And let's help grow the anime community here on the Andres Array channel. Because after this show, guys, or even maybe when I have a little bit more free space with other shows, we can add more animations here on this channel. But we would do need a bigger fandom, a bigger group of people so we can continue to discuss animations and as well this great show that is just has captivated me with already four episodes in hair flip with that being said guys i'll see you next time with more attack on the titan